Hello, I'm Emmett. I'm just gonna come right out. I have no idea what's going on. Basically, it follows a story of a guy called Emmett uh, who there's nothing special about him. He's an ordinary character and he's so ordinary that he's actually described as extraordinary. Um, but he gets involved in a situation where people think he's something he's not and we sort of follow that saga um, that plays out and basically uh, we're following the story of the film. So uh, we have 15 levels in the game and they're hitting all of the same sort of main beat points of the film. Uh, so you get to follow that story uh, and again we get to create that in a video game so it's great for us. Yeah, it's, it's different for us, but it's a very exciting opportunity. So um, the movie is going to be absolutely fantastic and the game's also going to be really great. So uh, we get to do a lot of stuff with to basically Lego toys. So Lego releasing some play sets uh, and really backing this sort of uh, this movie and there's really cool toys that are going to be coming out. So we're going to be able to put them into the game and people are going to be able to see them in the game and use them. Um, and people will get to know the characters like they do for the other franchises. So as people get more familiar with the film and the game, then these things will just come more naturally to them. And it's a really great story, so people enjoy playing it. The LEGO games are family games. They are designed so that kids can play them, but also that parents enjoy them. So that's why the humour is like that. So there's always slapstick stuff um, because LEGO characters falling over is always funny. Um, and there's always lots of random things that we're able to do as well because that, again, with LEGO, it just comes across as very, very funny. Where we do have the dialogue, that allows us to have proper jokes. So there's sort of references, like you say, and just sort of actual jokes that so, might go over kids' heads, but parents will get them, so that allows us to do this sort of dual humour, like you say, and it's something that works very well in LEGO games. Uh, every game has uh, a different approach to it, but where we're working with LEGO, um, it's a relationship that we've built up over a number of years. Uh, we work very well together with LEGO, so approaching this game with them is an exciting opportunity because um, there's a lot of stuff that they're creating that we want to get into this game. Um, and it, it's a different uh, sort of uh, dynamic where we're just working with LEGO. Um, but it's also, it's just a great opportunity for us. Awesome! Could you make one of these in orange? I only work in black and sometimes very, very dark gray.